just the bag of coffee? Yes. Do you want anything to drink? No, thanks. Right here? Okay. And whole beans all right for you? That's great. Okay, 1705. Good. great Monday. It's going to be a great week. I'm excited. I'm at work. Things are good. Hope you guys are having a really great Wednesday. Is that when this goes up? I don't remember anymore. I really don't. I don't know what's wrong with me. can't remember my days. <laughs> I woke up early, did some freelance this morning, uh, and then came to work. I don't have any lunch, so I'm going to go get a juice um, from my favorite place, the Sprout and Pour. I love that place. I'm actually going to sit there and do a little bit of work. Uh, I kind of got laid on a lot of bars, so I'm gonna do that while I'm out there. So it's gonna be great. <laughs> to the juice bar but there is a very important first place to go and that first place I have just arrived at the first place okay, how many times can I say that is Seeds Coffee Company because as if I need more caffeine I am actually out of really good beans so I'm gonna run in here and get me something earthy So I'm looking for something. I want some beans from you guys. Okay. Uh, awesome. I want, I'm looking for some earthy. Something earthy. Okay. Yeah. Like I would go with our Colombian. Colombian. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, it should be over there on the far left. Cool. Okay. Is this it? Yes. Cool. Is there anything else I can get for you? That's it. Alright, so just the bag of coffee. Yes. Do you want anything to drink? No thanks. Okay. And whole beans all right for you? That's great. Okay. It's 1705. really stoked. Um, I was out of good coffee, so. Okay, yeah, it was your first time. I'll stay right there, right? I can just drive with that on there, right? I'm actually running late to a meeting now, which that kind of sucks. Sorry, but I did tell them before I left that I was going to lunch and that I only had like a 40, 30 minute lunch according to their calendar because of the meeting time and I thought that was like crazy and I said, hey listen, I'm gonna try and be back. Sorry. And they were like, no big deal. Also, I used to work uh, right up there. Yeah.
That's good coffee. I am home, and it feels so good to be home. I did step in something wet just now, but I'm pretty sure it's from cooking, because this lovely lady has been cooking. They missed you in yesterday's vlog. Oh, I missed being in yesterday's vlog, but I did enjoy my relaxing day. So we are cooking, and we have Anna's famous green beans, which have onion and bacon. The bacon's not in it yet. No, but, but it will be. And it's gonna have um, almonds. Which are right here, the almonds crushed up. We used the vegetable dicer to chop those up, uh, which it actually worked out really well. We had to put in like just four or five almonds. I initially put in probably like 30 and it did not uh, dice at all, which makes total sense because almonds are pretty rough, you know? And I'm just glad to have that thing because it makes chopping things a lot easier, which I don't know if that's lazy or not, but it, it is what it is. Oh ho, we have chicken as well. What kind of chicken? What is it seasoned with? I just seasoned it with a little bit of olive oil, garlic pepper, and black pepper. Interesting. It I sounds know. delicious. We'll see. I went with. It smells good too. Um, I baked it instead of sauteing. I don't know why I did. I just did. Instead and of cooking it in have, the skillet. Yeah. And we also have asparagus that's still in the oven. Which Chef Ramsay approved? I don't think he would punch it and tell me it's raw. Well, that's good. <laughs> <laughs> it's raw! Send it back! Get out of my kitchen! It's raw! Oh my goodness, girl. Oh my goodness. Look at these green beans, this mm. chicken, and asparagus, oh, and the fork. Yeah, it's very green, but... <laughs> but it looks delicious. It does. It smells... Oh, yeah. I'm more excited about the green beans because I haven't had them in a while and they are my absolute favorite. I know. Love my green beans. Great job, babe. High five. And now it's time for dessert. Nom nom. What is on the menu for dessert, Randall? Tonight we feature the berry de straw. It's very good. The berry de straw has a very distinct red uh, color into it and a very distinctive sweet taste. Nom nom. It's one of my favorites for sure. Is it your favorite too, Randall? He's one of. <laughs> I'm not sure what that voice was. That was my special chef voice, I guess. I don't know. But we are having strawberries for dessert. We both wanted something sweet. And then I remembered that I had strawberries. So, gosh. They are organic strawberries because they are indeed part of the Dirty Dozen. You should explain that. <laughs> I should. It sounds very strange. There are 12 fruits and veggies that are on the list called the Dirty Dozen, and it's just these 12. I think most of your vegetables you should buy organic because they have a lot of pesticides. If you do not think that pesticides are harming you, and then you should just ignore my advice. But I stick to my Dirty Dozen list. <laughs> anyway, they are organic. They're tasty. I'm excited. They're gonna be scrumptious in my tummy. And his too, I guess, if I'm gonna share. I guess I'll share. Girl, you best. I best share. You best share. <laughs> Dinner was delicious. Oh, it was so good. I love, love, love those green beans. You know, I'm not the hugest fan of asparagus though. But man, when it's wrapped in bacon, it's pretty tasty. It's pretty tasty. And the chicken that Anna cooked was spot on. It really tasted like, I don't even know, some sort of fancy chicken nugget. We ended up like cutting the chicken up into smaller bits um, and we didn't have like a larger chicken breast each. And because of that, it really did taste like some sort of chicken nuggets. It tasted really, really, really good. Also, guess what I got today? Chica, check it out. I got my new Apple Watch band. This one is a leather one. And no, it is not from Apple because those are pretty expensive. And I think maybe one day I'll have one of those, the real ones. But for now, this one is from a company. I'm trying to look at the name. It's like Jill Sun case or something. But anyway, I, I like it. It's, it's, it's pretty cool. Jason case is the name of it. And see, here is the exact same band, but it's in 38 millimeter. You remember, remember guys when I ordered the wrong size? Yeah. Well, I ordered the right size now. And I think I'm gonna just return this one because there's no sense in me having it. And I know I mentioned like selling it or something on the vlog, but I mean, you could just order a new one. It would just be much easier and 
get to you faster because of Amazon Prime, you know, so you should just order a new one. I like it though. I wanted something that was a little bit dressier than just the black watch band that I have. I think it's gonna fit really nice with um, some nicer outfits that I have. Like today, the one I was wearing today. I felt like I looked pretty sharp today and man, this thing would have went with it. So now for the rest of the night, I think that I'm gonna go do a little bit of freelance work. Someone mentioned something uh, in one of the comments about burning candle at both ends. I hear you, I understand completely about me working so much and being so tired, I know. But I've, I've just gotta hustle. Like I love it, it's something I, I'm getting back into. I love it, the freelance, it's just great. Work, 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 but fun, it's fun work. I am really enjoying it. And when you really enjoy work, it really doesn't feel like work. Okay, I think that's all for today, but before I go, I wanted to let everyone know that we do have t-shirts, like we have the design. I think we mentioned this, Kyle came up with an idea, we gave it to Micah, Micah's worked on a few uh, drafts of it and designs, we've loved what he's shown us so far, and we're ready to roll with it, but he's like, no, I got one more, I got something else, like he, he wants to show us one more thing before we decide, so. We're waiting on that. Probably gonna launch this t-shirt campaign sometime tomorrow. We'll see. So I would just look for it on the next vlog or you could probably follow us on Twitter and find out more information to see if we've already launched it by the time you watch this. Thank you guys so much for all of your support and love and kind words. We It just really means a lot to us. Thank you so, so much. Hope you guys have enjoyed your ride. Thank you for watching and we'll talk to you soon. God bless.